Hey everybody, as you can see we got the swimming tank, a so called APC and let me explain why did I downgrade my weapon from sand battery to stock weapon so um, we got the sand battery, the upgraded weapon right here and we got the stock uh, insurgent pickup custom right here and let's see how many shots uh, it's gonna take to explode that car that's one two Three, four, five. Five shots. A uh, sand battery looks much better than a stock weapon, but it's limited. You got 60 rockets, which is a problem because why do we buy this vehicle? We want this for free mode. Like, you cannot really use this in heists or anything. So, like, you do not want to get out of the rockets when you probably have, like, five-star police coming after you when you're using this vehicle. And you cannot really shoot and drive unless you have two players in a uh, vehicle because you have to switch your position from driver to the gunner by holding H button on your keyboard. So sand battery has a faster shooting rate as you can see like it shoots pretty fast but again like it's just limited and that sucks. Also upgrading to this weapon will cost $200,000 and um, it's just a waste of money I would say. Also upgrading to sand battery will kind of make your car uh, clunky. I don't know if it's gonna catch some random objects on the streets like it was never a problem for me at least because I don't really use this vehicle often so I cannot tell if it's a problem but it just becomes physically bigger and also will cover your view. You have much better view with a stock weapon because of its size, it's just smaller. Now let's take a look at the stock weapon. The Insurgent Pickup Custom again, again the exact same vehicle, not upgraded or anything. So that's one, two, three. Only takes three shots to explode the car. So as you can see, the stock weapon is stronger. It has a slower shooting rate, but it's unlimited which is what you want on a free mode. I don't know about the situation where you encounter the other APC because uh, the one with the faster shooting rate might be having an advantage on a 1v1 fight but that's just never gonna happen and I highly recommend not to upgrade your weapons everything you need on a tank this weapon has it also downgrading it cost me eighty thousand dollars which is just ridiculous just to get your old weapon back so that's the comparison of the stock weapon and the sand battery i hope this was helpful thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe